Hey y'all and welcome back. I asked the other day on a video if you'd like to see some updates on my food trailer and unanimously everybody's like, yes, show updates. We'd love to see the food trailer, love to see the progress, whatever. Well, today's the day. I'm not gonna really work on it in this video, but I am gonna give you, show you it, you know, show you the overview. It's actually a used food trailer, so don't expect something, you know, immaculate and fancy, but I, I kind of like it. I think it's got a lot of potential. Uh, I'm going to take you through it, just kind of show you the overview outside of it, the inside of it, you know, what all has to be done, the work. we got a lot of cleaning to do. That's the main thing, a lot of cleaning. we got some decals we got to get made, all kind of things. Now, we can talk about this all day long, but I think the best thing to do is go over there and show you. So, let's go. Well, here is the outside of it. Uh, as you see, it's still got some vinyl on it, and we need to get that off from the previous owner. Service window, we got some floodlights there. What I do like about this one is a toy hauler. So this whole back can let down and I have access to it from there. So let's see, it's going around here. We already got the vinyl off of this side. And as you see, we have an access door. We have a hood there. Uh, it is a tandem axle trailer. Let's see here. We have a hundred pound tank here. And up under this cover here is our generator. So I'm going to Set you on a tripod and open that up and let you see it. Now this is one thing that I really like about this. Uh, my generator's in here, straight wired into the panel there. If I need access to it, the whole thing is on a hinge. It just hinges over and there it is. I have access to my generator right here. And it is bolted down, chained down, locked in, whatever I need. But I can close it up and over here, they actually put a cover here that I can undo and the exhaust comes out. Pretty cool. And on the front side, I like this right here. We have access panel that hinges up and I have access to everything from my generator right there without even having to move the cover. So yeah, that is really convenient there. So let's go ahead and open up the serving window. Set our serving tray up here. Good and steady. Windows up. Let's go inside. Get some power going here. Now I do remember this is a used truck, so we have a lot of work to do in here, but I think it's in pretty good shape to be used. Let's go inside and check it out. Welcome to Crazy Pops Kitchen. As you see, we have bought some lights here that we're gonna kind of hang up different places. But anyhow, let me widen this out so you get a really good view of everything here. Let's see, let's start over here some walk. We got a hand sink, we got our three base sink right here. We have our serving counter, you know, there's our window. Uh, we do have an air curtain above the window. Over here, we do have a instant water heater and the water gets hot really quick, really fast. The noise you hear is the water pump coming on. And as you see, I don't know if you can see it or not, but there's some blue flames in there. And that's what's heating up our water right now. The water does get steaming hot really fast. Uh, let's see here. Of course, breaker panel. We got a fire suppression system right here. Of course, extinguisher. Uh, another extinguisher. Let's see here. There's our water tanks. We got a 30 gallon fresh water tank and a 40 gallon gray water tank there. And I do like all this uh, diamond plate everywhere. It's gonna be really easy to clean. It's even on the ceilings. Let's go over here. Uh, let's see here. We have a hood. And on this hood, we do have its variable speed right here. So that's pretty cool. Don't know if that's normal, but I have it. We do have vents in the ceiling. Let's see what else we got here. Our griddle. Let's go to the griddle. We have a 24 inch griddle right here. Uh, two burners. This does have an oven, a convection oven right here. So that's pretty cool. Not sure if I'd use the convection oven. Can't never tell, but I have it if I need it. We have two deep fryers. When I say this thing needs cleaning, y'all, it needs cleaning. Let me look down in there. Yeah, a lot of cleaning to do. We have uh, three tray steam table. Of course, now these trays can be taken out and we can put smaller trays in here if we need to. But either way, we got a very big steam table here place to store all our trays and whatnot, our wax paper, gloves. We have a warmer right here. Pretty good size warmer. 
as you see we got one of the steam table trays in here kind of just hanging in there right now then that's that back right there that's that's actually the treads that you can walk up when i let that whole back back wall down you can walk up it we have a really good sized refrigerator right here as you can see it needs a good wiping out and cleaning out then we have a full size freezer right here then we have our sandwich prep station right here it's refrigerated and below it we actually have a refrigerator as you see it all needs good cleaning out give you a little closer view of some of the cleaning that we have to do as you see all around this griddle right here and this griddle top and down in here kind of slide these trays out i mean yeah look see i mean when i say it needs good cleaning we really got to do some cleaning in here really really do but it can be done i mean even grease hanging from the light fixtures that's okay we can get it clean we can do this well you know i told you we'd already took the vinyl off of this side as you can see you can still see the remnants of it and uh we're gonna get all that cleaned up and get it get us some new vinyl here put on here i actually already got a logo made to go on the side here uh i'll insert that right here So yeah, that's the logo, the sun's in my eyes bad. That's the logo I'm gonna use to put on the side here and whatever. I think our logo, our slogan or whatever you wanna call it is gonna be crazy good food. So it's gonna be Crazy Pops Kitchen, crazy good food. What y'all think of that? So yeah, that was a really quick video, kind of great little overview of what we have here going on with this food trailer so far. And as you see, a lot of cleaning has to be done. That's gonna be my first thing. We're really gonna start working on taking the vinyl off the side, doing a lot of cleaning. It's gonna be a process. Hopefully it won't take too long to get this thing up and running. Thank y'all for the interest in this. I really have to say that. Thank you for all your support. And if, Mr. Beast, if you see this, thank you for your part helping this make come true. Helping this dream of mine come true. Everybody out there has been such a great influence on getting to where I am today. Thank you so much. Hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see more videos of this food truck and the cleaning process and all the other stuff we're going through, let us know down in the comments. And with that, I want to thank you for everything and we'll see you next time.